Um, hmm. Mostly trash. I think Polymorph 4 can be okay. It's a little bit of reach. Can kill a Mawarg or some Sort of. Take it. Draw a spell and gain armor equal to its cost. Yeah, okay. Why not? Pyroblast. Okay. <laughs> Peasant's cool, but let's take a Pyro. It's a lot of health or whatever. A lot of, uh... Take the dragon over Sky Talon, I think. I hate Sky... Oh, I hate them all. <laughs> let's take the dragon. Uh, Spell Coiler. That's a good one. Uh, I like Bonker. Siphon Mana can be nice, too. We need card draw to make Siphon work. Well, Bonker is card draw, right? Let's take, take, take the Bonker. Uh, Mech Mage is going to want a Click Clocker. That's for sure. Parrot. Oh, dear. <laughs> I mean, we don't have to double Pyroblast. We could. Uh, let's take a Beetle here. Mecha Shark. Uh, Hyperborea. What's up, Hyperbobria? Bo Hyperbob. Um, Scribe is nice, but man, I really like drawing cards. There's an achievement. Get lethal with Pyroblast? Wasn't that already yet? Or is it a new achievement? Uh, probably the Pyro. Unless we've somehow encountered a bunch of Murlocs we don't know about. Pyro's okay. Flame Lance, Fireball. Both are decent. I think Fireball's better. You can go face. Uh, Spell Slinger's fun. Cl Clockwork's... I don't know, I hate that card. Let's take Spell Slinger. Uh, I'll take a Glutton here. For the new core? Oh, okay. Florist or Gangplank? I am a mage, so Florist doesn't really work. It was good in that Druid deck. Take a diver. Dang. What was the first bonker? Oh, is that a siphon mana? Eh. I don't mind having two bonkers. Um, I don't want gangster. We could run um, the sea scout. We have a, we could if we could score a couple more cheap mechs, that would be ideal. This card just feels really bad to me with uh, eight eight rushes and so many ways to just kill it, Illidaris and whatnot. A couple more cheap mechs. We'll run a bomber, I guess. Conjurer is fun. Wow. Yogg-Saron. Servant of Yogg is like the worst card ever. Hey, Cassie. Wow, welcome back. Uh, draw a mech. Reduce the cost of your mechs by one. If I had the uh, Colossal, I'd be more inclined. We could take the Flame Strike. It's very strong, and it's good with the Parrot. I mean, obviously, it's Flame Strike, but I like the mech card. I think it's cool. I don't think our deck wants Mistress with a Pyro and a Fireball. After you play a Naga, refresh your crystals. I guess we just take Mailbox Dancer. It's a two. Ooh, I want this and that, but we gotta go Amulet. Not as good as it was, but I think it's still good. This is kind of interesting. More burn is certainly not bad. This card should be pretty easy to activate in our deck, though. We have a coin, plus we'll go second in you know pretty much every game. Spell Coiler does want the spell in the first spell more though. I don't have that many spells of this guy though. I have been impressed by this card. I uh, will run a siphon here. I really like this card. This is good too, but I really like this one. The Viking Scholar. Thank you, Viking. We'll take the burn. Um, I think I'll take a dredge card here in case my next pick is the sunken uh, mech guy. That'd be cool. Uh, a crappy barrier. I'll take a rust rot. We can just trade it or play it on curve. It's not. It's not bad. And a big dragon. Yeah, I like this card. This deck seems good for a mage deck. It seems pretty reasonable. I think amulet is way better. There's less mage mirrors, and other classes can't handle the stats. There's less mage mirrors, and other classes can't handle the stats. Uh, I just mean that you get worse dragons. So, you're not getting like two 8-8s, eight or a 12-12, and a 4-12. There's a lot of um, low roll dragons in the pool. A lot more. There's a 2-8, a 3-2, um, a couple of like 4-1s, some 5-5s. Five 
Seven wins. Yeah, let's bet on uh, seven. I think this deck could go seven. It might go less than seven. Did I do that? Um, ASFD, thanks for the follow, and also the Viking Scholar. The Viking Scholar, 21 months. Sorry, I want to make sure I get that right for once. He did, it used to be even better in a previous rotation. That's disgusting. Yeah, in the Descent meta, there was a lot of 8-8s, and I don't know what else was in. Maybe it is better. It just feels like there weren't as many bad dragons. Maybe there are more good dragons now. There's two 12-12 Deathwings, but yeah. Okay, and thanks everybody. Appreciate the follow. I'm going to get up and stretch my legs. Um, maybe pour a little bit of caffeinated beverage. I'm pretty tired, but I, I didn't have any caffeine. Maybe I should not be so bold. Khadgar versus Valera. Watch your back. There's no turning back now. Kind of want to hold it. Mech start? Yeah, mechs are pretty good. I was going to coin these two out, but maybe I coined these two. Would have been a 12 win deck in the previous meta? No. That's not true. The decks are definitely overall weaker than the premium mage decks from, from last meta. Those decks just had two two Drake Fires, two runes, unlimited removal. Why does it always sound <laughs> like you rear-ended a car when you open your bridge? I don't know. I should probably mute the mic. I should get in the habit of doing that. No oh yeah, you miss rune? Yeah, we didn't get rune. The, the meta just doesn't have meteor and rolling fireball to get you through the mid game against some decks. Sort of. Ruins, get ahead. These aren't mechs, are they? Oh, they are. That's insane. Well, then I'll keep the shark alive. The way Swordfish freezes in midair while you dredge makes me uncomfortable. I'm with you. Me too. Also, what? Amulet? Played and deck win rate have both gone up marginally from the last 14 days. Even though Mage has gone down. So while the dragons may be smaller, it's better positioned in the meta. That's probably fair. That's probably fair. Maybe um just because there are less mages playing it, right? Where in the mirror match it's gonna drag the win rate down. So you both play it and then it only has a 50% played win rate. So if there's fewer of them, then it's gonna it's gonna benefit the, the numbers, right? People are playing less mage. My two favorite classes have been dominant this meta and the last. What are your two favorite classes? 137%, good golly. Let's see how low we can take it. I'm gonna go see if anybody's watching our latest YouTube video, don't mind me.
I'm not gonna fall for it. I'm not falling for it. He's trying to rob me of my experience points by getting a shorter game. Why is Hunter so bad? Um, we highlighted it earlier why any class is good or bad, but without looking at the exact numbers again, Druid's got Miracle Growth, Flipper Friends, and Scales in like almost 50% of their decks. If you go to Hunter's three most common cards, which I don't even know what they are, but looking at them right now, their, their three most common cards, I don't even know what they are, are in 38, 37, and 32% of their decks. So you're like almost 15 or 20% more likely to get the most common cards from Druid offered. So right off the bat there, and what are their most common cards? Bloodseeker, Mountain Bear, and Deadly Shot. So it's like, would you like to draft more Bloodseekers and Mountain Bears? Like, yeah, you would. If you draft Hunter, you're statistically less likely to get him. And then the numbers drop off even more after that. Knight Captain's in 25% of decks. I wonder. I bet it's higher in Druid for some reason. I bet it's higher for some reason. It's in almost 29% of decks. So are people, like, drafting passing Knight Captains in Hunter? No. I'm sure they're not. And that just starts to bear out when you you know look at a huge sample size of everyone playing all the runs. You're just more likely to get even the good common, neutral commons probably in Druid. Isn't this the case of Druid being the most drafted, hence more samples? Uh, no, because it's a percentage of decks that have it. So if you have 100 Druid decks, 50% of them will have that card. If you have 1,000, 500 will. If you have a uh, Hunter, and you draft 100 decks, on average, 37% are going to have a Mountain Bear. And if you draft 1,000, 370 of them are going to have, statistically speaking, you know, on average, that's what that's what the, the, the rate of decks that have those cards are. Now you could argue maybe people are passing Mountain Bears. I would say that that's foolish. But you could. Let's see, what do I do? Um, I guess. You know what I mean? I have an interesting pick. Corrupted Healbot versus Heart of the Wild. Heart of the Wild looks better if I don't hit my Prester. Healbot better if I do. Um, I like Heart of the Wild. I don't love it, but... I don't like Corrupted Healbot at all, really. And I wouldn't... I wouldn't, you know, cite Prester as a real reason to take a bad card over a, you know, over a fine card. Wanting to have a, wanting to have like a, a net, you know, or a, or a, a critical mass of um, minions, I think it's more relevant than being like, well, it's overstatted or whatever, but it's bad. It's overstatted with a bad effect. I should have gone face. I want to play this. It's fine. We can still get the trade, maybe. We can discount more later. Any idea on why that is? Aren't we all assuming there are no micro adjustments? There are no micro adjustments. So this is just what what it, I think it is is when they release a new arena rotation, it defaults to some old offering rate from when they made some adjustment or whatever the default is without adjustments. So, maybe certain sets, like, every, I don't know, somebody could probably go and look at the uh, some of the data and, and come to some conclusions. And what am I supposed to do here? If I had a cheap mech, that'd be cool. So it's like maybe every time um, Whispers of the Old Gods in, maybe Druid has a 10% increase in whatever class card offering rate. And then they just, you know, spit it out. They don't adjust anything. This card's really good. This card's pretty good too. Hmm. I really don't want to give him that. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. Ten armor. Oh, I gained ten. Yeah, that's right. I forgot. Man, that card seems good. 
Last time it was around, it didn't seem good. It's been here before, right? It's an old set. Maybe there was no 10 cost spells or something? No, I mean, you don't need to spend 10. Is that the fireball to 4 4? I'd really prefer not to. You want it? I got it. It's never gonna work. We're never gonna make it to to that. It's just not gonna happen. I've lived that dream. I've lived that nightmare. There's a formula that eva elevated a class card and spell. Yeah, yeah. I've had that in the past. And I've kind of mentioned before. This is partially, you know, me speculating, but. They've mentioned they, that the person that does micro adjustments has left. But my understanding of it is that they can still make adjustments. It seems like somebody just ran a program or put in the effort to, to have a system of how they did the adjustments. And now that that person is gone or that program is not, you know, whatever, available to them. They don't know what changes to make, or they don't have an interest in making the changes. It's like, they can make them. It seems as though they can reduce the offering rates of She's things still. Uh, I can shrink everything again? I don't really want to do that right now though, right? Let's find something. Oh, I can get that? Um, what are they hiring you for it there, Zach? They probably couldn't afford me, unfortunately. I would, I, as I've mentioned in the past, I'd want an abundance of money to help them with those things. And I'd want to work from home. And I wouldn't want to work very much at all. Like, the rate at which they would be paying me would be astronomical. But I'd be happy to do it under those circumstances. I mean, it doesn't seem to be a priority. Uh, you know, nothing really feels like a priority lately. Battlegrounds has kind of been bunk for a bit. Standard is just Druid and, uh... No, I I'm sure it's, you know, you had a big acquisition and sh they've talked about publicly the shuffling of kind of like responsibilities and whatnot um, that they've sort of had to go through. So... It feels like Hearthstone maybe has taken a bit of a backseat somewhat. But, or, or maybe they're just restructuring. I mean, they've talked about restructuring sort of the responsibilities of people within the team publicly. So, I don't know. I don't think it's really like doom and gloom. I think the set's been a smash hit for the most part. I think... Uh, This is much better than what we had. It's much better than the last two two metas, I feel so. At least for my experience so far. Time may pass. When do you think they'll hire an enthusiastic Time arena expert to do it? Probably never. I mean, like these things, you know, as it gets mentioned and whatnot, like it needs to generate revenue, right? It needs to you need to be able to turn this. I have a mech on board somehow. <laughs> Um, it needs to generate revenue, and if it can't do that, then... Then it's just not gonna happen. I can kill this. I could just start unloading crap into his face. Hmm. Yeah, I'll play him somewhat safe. I'll play that guy too. Pyro face than Grey Sage next turn. I think it's random, right? Isn't it a random target? Some people who have the means to do it would probably do it for what they offer. Yeah, but like when you already have somebody employed that you can assign to do it without hiring someone new, then that's just what you'll do, right? Whoever is an arena expert cannot be enthusiastic about anything. <laughs> True. 
So true. Cosmetics are all there are now? Yeah, there's a big focus on cosmetics. And maybe that's what, you know, rather than buy, hire a couple extra whatever game designers, maybe you're, you're paying a couple extra artists and maybe you're making more money because of that. You know, it kind of is what it is. Did he awakens? He didn't awakens, right? Maybe he did. He did? Oh, he did? I really don't pay that much attention to the game. Has anybody else noticed that? Do I live in Portland? No. I live south of Portland. I want to go to Portland. Side note, I have a big under the skin pimple behind my ear in like the crux of my earlobe. I'm very happy that it shrunk a little, but man, that sucker's big and it hurts. Pyro time? We'll see. He just plays nothing but taunts, so we won't be able to pyro. Hate those? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if this is good. What if I polymorph it and play this? There's too much crap in my way. I want to cast spells so that this is available to me to wipe up board if I need to. This board looks like last meta. Yeah, these freaking Yaceras. Oh, there's a play here. I'm just not sure what it is. This one. What else am I doing here? Maybe he heals a bit. Is that lethal? Yeah. Yeah, we'll just put him really low. I just don't- I wanna- If I can't kill him this turn, I wanna be able to set this up. Okay. We drafted Wild Paw, boys! Remain off arena servers until further notice. Well, everybody drafts Wild Paw. As soon as you queue into a- uh, As soon as you queue into a, um... Shaman above like two wins, they have three of them. Can't heal for seven, right? But an 8 8, he could have killed his own 8 8, maybe. This guy's deck was insane and it's not even close. Yeah, that really wasn't that close. Had lethal if you trade it and made your own minion a boar? Uh, I don't think so. Maybe. Trade. Oh, maybe. Uh, it three taunts though, right? possible but I don't know that would see that would imply that I miss lethal I haven't missed lethal yet ever so probably not he could have but deathwing would be lethal on board yeah true true so true what day is it today Wednesday Thursday morning I gotta check for some Pokemon cards is it gonna rain tomorrow I will fight with honor no turning back now. What's the weather like in my mom where my mom and dad live? I'll keep it. It's probably more likely that he has a uh Oh my god. It's gonna be 90 next week there. 70 tomorrow though. What about where I live? Oh my god, rain. More rain? I love this song. It's not gonna rain all day though, is it? Maybe. What's it with you and Dreads and Pokemon cards? Uh, they're fun. I like them. They're shiny. When people use their Twitch Primes, <laughs> I trade them for Pokemon cards. I love you. I love you too, Tempili. As much as a man can love another man in his Twitch chat. Hey, Cassie, I got good news. 
You, you got fired. You don't have to go to work ever again. <laughs> That's the most expensive Pokemon card I got. My first edition, uh, PSA 10 Charizard, I think. I don't really know. I heard it was up over $50 recently, so. If he gives a Divine Shield, it's fucking annoying. How much is that? I think like a million? 250,000 to a million? I wish I was fired. <laughs> Hello, Redbeard. What's up, Keg W? It's so good to have you. Mage, right? Watch this. Check this out, Keg W. Getting excited? I know how much you love Mage. Um, golly, I don't want to ping. I'm going to double trade if I can. No. If I had a two drop, I would uh, I would do things differently. Mage, why are you leaving? My boss is too dependent on me. They are. They are too dependent on you. I agree. That's not a that's not a beast. How's that not a beast? Looks like a beast to me. It's probably reckoning, huh? Uh, what? Oh, competitive spirit. What the fuck is that card? I don't believe you. Show it. It's in a safe. I don't even know where it is, so I can't be robbed of it. It's in a safe. I'm not even privy to the information. One guy holds the key, but he doesn't know where it is, and another guy holds a holds the card, and he lives in the safe. And he doesn't know where the guy with the key is, or where he where he doesn't even know what city he lives in, or, or if he's, he, it could be on a moon base for all he knows. When he signed the waiver, we told him that moon base was possible. He said, will you put me on the moon? And I, he said, maybe. In case he ever has ideas of telling people where he is. We turn the heat on sometimes when it's cold out. And we to put the air on when, it, when it's really hot out. So he doesn't know he can't get, the, he can't get his lateral, his unilateral location based off of the equator. Serious business. What the flippin' skip? Um, if I ping, I have four mana. Fours? Not great. I could play this. Let's this thing trade in a more tangible way. I should probably trade. I, I should probably have. Maybe. Wow, I'm liking the mage now. It's almost not seen. Usually doesn't even get seven wins in this meta. Who? Dreads? Yeah, but I do, of course. A lot of seven win runs for Redbeard. After five years, you have to sell the card to finance the, sec <laughs> the security setup. Well, I'm hoping that the price of the card will continue to go up. <laughs> but yes, it is very costly. <laughs> have three people on a yearly salary and one of them lives on the goddamn moon. <laughs> That's great. It's funny. <laughs> I hadn't really necessarily. Fuck. Fuck that starfish. Uh, I hadn't really considered that. No, dude. I, I did that same card. I never got anything. Card looks cool and golden. Gotta be kind of good, right? We get a lot of stats. Uh, if I can kill the one one, sure, I'll take it. Oh, I forgot I got two of them. Oh my god. Is that a fart rebus in the title? What's a rebus? Why is Silent Panda still two four? Silent Panda still two four. Um, the the card that's its base stats now. They did a hot fix so that those are stats. It's not buffed. It just looks like it's buffed until they do the next update. Oh, it's the second time. A light in the darkness. Somebody cast a light in the darkness and got pressed her against me. Really fucking rude. I mean, I'm gonna burn him up, but still. 
Yeah, I probably want to play this. Yeah. Over here. Could look for a pyro, but we don't have to do it this turn. As long as we pick up pyro before turn 10. Hey, remember we broke a thousand viewers again today? Dude, that's awesome. As long as people keep remembering to follow, there's a small possibility that our Twitch channel may grow. That's wild. But if they forget to follow, then we might not. What? Oh. Can I die? I mean, I can die. What if I just do this? And I, like, don't get battle mastered or something? Just, I wish I had played that two turns ago. Okay, I can get Flame Strike. I can get Pyro Blast. I can shoot something. I could shoot that. Let's see what we get. Oh, that's bad. Okay, well, we missed everything. Wait, these go face, don't they? Three, five. Hmm. How much does he have? 4, 8, 12, 16, 20. He needs 9 damage to kill us? There must be a way. Huh. Maybe I can get a... Just need to kill them? Well, yeah. Maybe if I get a fireball, I could... No. Beyond your comprehension. Fuck. He needs 10 damage to kill us now. This deck seems very fun to play, it's hard. I was arena this new standard. I tried one, I felt like it was nothing like last. Yeah, it's way different. I think it's really fun. I think it's really fun. Today's been a little tougher. Our good decks have done okay, but have queued into a lot of good decks, and we've rolled a couple of stinkers, but... Um, still, it's been fun. It's nice when things change. I, uh, I do enjoy that. And the streams have been good. What I care more about is the streams going well. If it's, you know, people are having fun, if, you know, we're, we're kind of engaged. If the Twitch numbers are good, like if we have a lot of viewers, that's what I care more about. But it's a lot easier to, you know, have fun and, and be happy if the, if the games are fun too. 20 healing and 40 missiles now. I left Arena because the last patch and now I'm back and I really enjoy it. Yeah, I didn't really have that luxury, but I definitely played a little less. Did a couple five and six hour shift, uh, you know, streams instead of uh, longer. Yeah, that deck looks a little better than <laughs> my hunters. Um, I haven't played too many because it's so bad, but yeah. Hyd Hydralodon, Hydralodon, Cornelius, Double Diver, Double Drake, Mountain Bear. It's like you rolled the good hunter. And uh, I just, I wish that was more common so that like, you know, I could play some hunter. 
Or when I did choose to play Hunter, I could get some good cards. But thank you for the 100 bits and congrats, man. I hope the deck uh, keeps winning. Hope you go 12. You seem like a nice guy and all, but it seems a bit early to get engaged. Are you talking to me? Love is just an arrangement I love that card in Druid. I hate this Bomber card. You know why? Because of that shit right there. Strictly. All too common, Mr. Bomber. Rokoji Ma, what's up, Roko? Red Salt losing Joust, obviously. Mad Bomber hitting his own face, clearly. Titanic Lackey, is it possible? Can I get a Titanic Lackey? My missiles go face. Yes, I remember that. Going third. <sighs> Tell me about it. Puzzle box. <laughs> Rex, you. <laughs> karma. What karma? I drafted the card. I played him. He failed us. You cursed it. I didn't curse nothing. I am going to... Do what? I guess this? No way he's gonna sink the ship! I'd rather get the amulet, but whatever. Ten armor's a lot. Going third, yeah, that's the best. It's the best bit there. Going third. They uh, they can flipper friends this turn if it got discounted by the florist. Mark of the fucking wild. You gotta be kidding me. I need to make it to Flame Strike. At this rate, it's not looking super good. I'm taking 10 here. I'd really like three more HP from that bomber. That screwed me. So Fireball 1. Um, I mean, that, that can get chomped up by the Flame Strike. Fireball so I don't die. Or I just let him push six. Um, one fireball for four HP. I'm only gonna take six this turn. I can throw that away. Throw this away. Give him the coin, give me the coin. Am I cashing in the coin? Reflect. This might save me 4 oh, HP anyway. Right. I, know, I feel pretty bad about this. So far. I do. Hunter is faring far better than mine did. Mine wasn't quite as good, but I only went five because I drew Hydralodon three times out of eight games. Hope he spams the board. Yeah, it's kind of like a couple things. One, we're sort of tipping our hand by doing nothing. Two, he might play something that just doesn't, uh, you know, doesn't die to flame strike. So. So, so yeah, we have to hope. We're gonna need to draw like a source of cheap damage. We could fireball it, but it still gets kind of dicey. You could just drop a miracle growth here or something. I could, um, it's not a lot of power, so that's, that's nice. I could coin out the sleepy, but that doesn't feel great. So I think we kind of just have to do this. Hope we can piece together a turn here. I can coin this and see maybe we get an ice barrier beyond your comprehension uh mana would have been good ignite is the same thing effectively drawing multiple cards could be good but i don't have a naga okay so let's take that 
And we'll put our faith in the uh, dragon, I guess. Golden Mailbox Dancer is a bit lewd. You're right. He's doing a lot of thrusting. I'd love to see the cards in his hand right now, and then also know what his next couple top decks are. Oh. Feels like we probably come back subject to like, you know, a rune or a, or a flipper friend's draw, being able to avoid one for a turn or two. I want to know what this is. Did I play WoW in the past? I did not. I wish I did. I think I would have really enjoyed it back in its heyday when it first came out, but... Bomber? Yeah. That bomber screwed us. We knew that when, you know, we knew that on turn one. Uh, C2. What's up, C2? Thank you for the follow, C2. Nice music. Yeah, I like this tune. I think it's neato. Cake is cake. I think he says, um, lick, lick her kitty. Her kitty. Zelda, which I believe doesn't mean her actual pet house cat. I think it was written by Mailbox Dancer. Does he dare screw me in back-to-back -back games? Perhaps he doth dare. Oh, that's not too far off. No. Cakes. Kitties. Ugh. Naked human anatomy. Yuck. No, thank you, sir. See, now I'm a little, a little lost. I play this and, and try to follow up with that. Probably go bonker into these two, getting the guaranteed buff. Unless we need the pings. Maybe we play it in the opposite direction? Opposite combination? I brought my bonking club. Yeah, he gets a 1-1. One -one. He probably has to waste it. Maybe. In Italian, we'd say you were born on a mountain of soap. <laughs> what did that mean? What does that mean? Hey, I just want to say, if you just left, fuck you. If you just got here, welcome to the show. Because you know, if they left, they you know they don't they can't hear. They don't know that I said that. I just left. No, you didn't. You're here. Hey, Grime. What's up, Grim? Thank you. Don't do that. All right, so what do we need? What do we want? I think what we actually want, then, is the triggers. Because if it's a 5-4... Uh, actually, that stops Night Captain. But you can always slap there and Night Captain. So we want the... We want the missiles. So after you summon a mech. After I summon a mech. Okay. If you're gonna miss, you wanna miss on all three, I think. We didn't, but that's okay. What if you just came back from cleaning the oven? Then... What? Did you clean the oven? Uh, if anybody was here yesterday, I was telling the anecdote, anecdotal story that my mom and dad had got an offer which they accepted on their house. The person backed out, apparently. They had like seven days to back out or something. But they got a lot of offers, so they're gonna like, you know, redo some stuff. But I was talking to my mom, she's like, yeah, I guess I'll like clean the house more. Like, I was like, you should, uh, I told her, you should hire somebody to clean it. 
And my mom says to me, she says, hell no. I'm like, what do you mean, hell no? She's like, your sister, my sister's coming over and she's bringing a vacuum. <laughs> okay, I would just have somebody clean it for me. Whatever you sell in your house, why are you gonna scrub your, get in your hands and knees and scrub it? Somebody else would probably be happy to earn some money and you could relax. Or just don't clean it. <laughs> Tell them, hey. You're buying the dirt that comes to you. You could value the dirt at something. To save money. My mama and my daddy are like 70 years old. I, I gave up cleaning a long time ago. Almost good, but not good. Oh, wait. Shit. Wait, which one am I pinging? This one? Bought my house two years ago and they left all the dirt for me. <laughs> you probably got a discount. <laughs> or you bagged it up and started selling your own brand of manure. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> but they sold you a really dirty house. Where do you, where do you live, Griff Ball? Do you like your house? Is it haunted by any chance? I was about to leave, but you convinced me to stay. You're going to know that I'm going to talk trash about you when you leave. But you have to take three flipper friends. Call me when you get seven, okay? Top tilt. That's how many you need. Most of them have... Most decks have two at least. I can't ping that anymore. I've got a feeling we're dead. They're steel. That's what makes them tasty. Dang. Oh no, another prester. Another prestor. I've got plenty of I have a flame strike. Uh, it's probably not even enough now, right? We take nine. Um, yes. If we're not conceding, we could do something like this. Maybe no, not even. Um, not even a pyroblast. Maybe we draw amulet. Oh, I only have eight mana. Man. Tough runs today. That's quite unfortunate. Yeah, high rolling opponents. Maybe no, no, no. <laughs> A lot of high rolls. Not so many for us today, but yeah, you know what are you gonna do? Deck's pretty good. Just lost to one Prester and. One of those games where, like, you know, five straight turns, somebody has the answer for you. And that's not good. That's not good at all. Hey, Griff Ball, that's good. Thanks for the Prime. Thanks for the Prime. That's cool. I'm gonna try to get this win in your honor, Griff Ball. This fucking dragon, get him out of my sight. Flame Shy, I mean, these are good cards. Well, this is a good card. I don't, I definitely don't want it in my opening hand, but. Could have used a flame strike last game, so maybe it's good that we have one. Possible. Oh my god, I thought we were four and two. I need we need to get to at least a five. Come on. Five's pretty good. The calm before the storm. Let's see, what do I do? 
I think I'll take that. Yeah, it's expensive, but I'm gonna have spells. I could use this next turn, right? I mean, hopefully. Oh man, nobody's chatting. I don't have anything to say. I might be talking about Hearthstone. There's always that possibility. Um, I could hold it, bump, ping, play that, and get more discounts, maybe. Maybe that's okay. Um, yeah, maybe. Chat is dead. Sometimes if you say chat's dead, then everybody will wake up and do little smiley faces. Which is cool. Two to three is always the slowest hour. Like, almost every night and some big hearthstone streamers came on and some other smaller hearthstone streamers smaller um that you know we share some communities with kind of jumped on so some people probably like okay i'll go watch amaranth wiggle her naughty bits maybe that was a mistake hmm, where did that no Perfect, come from right I've been summoned Asanov. I wonder what you guys are doing. Hey, you guys, um, you guys like sit and watch Twitch, or do you just have like Arena going or another game, or you're like watching YouTube videos? The other, some, like I like to sit in bed and like just have Twitch on my phone, and like not chat and just have it on when I wake up in the morning. Take like an hour to get out of bed. Just, Open it up, put it on. And sometimes after the stream, I like to end. And then I like to turn off my computer and sometimes put Twitch on the TV. If like if we raided somebody, I want to watch somebody, I'll just watch on TV. I don't like, you know, I don't like to chat. Smiley face, less than three. I'm playing Arena on one screen and I have Twitch and YouTube on my second. There you go. Never watch Twitch without doing at least two other things. I find it to be kind of nice no way to like just sit and watch twitch sometimes but sometimes i want to like fast forward because i do that with youtube so i was watching asmodai the other day i just had him on the tv and like the queue was going and i was like oh, how do i oh i just i guess i have to just sit here <laughs> i don't have a choice eating lunch and watching water sound i'm hungry i'm hungry today mm -mm -mm. Play this and this and eventually i'm gonna start playing some spells right eventually playing arena and yawn in the background yeah i'll play battlegrounds most of the time if if i'm watching dreads i'll like play battlegrounds or i don't know Sometimes I'll mute him and just have like a like a like a YouTube video. Sometimes something like, oh okay. But kind of like I like like already said, I kind of need like two things going on at all all the time now. I think it's not healthy. Like I, I can't like sit and watch Twitch without also like watching YouTube at the same time. Usually you start while I drink my coffee and then I leave you on until I get into a meeting. And then turn the volume down because you said it's preferable once. Then, after my meetings, I end, I take a break and chat for a while, and I go back on my work PC. I like learning about your guys' days. I watch while playing or have it on the TV in bed. I need to get a TV for my bedroom. I just watch on my phone, but it probably would be nice to have like a big TV in there, you know? I have to do two things at the same time. Whenever I watch Redbeard, I have to touch myself. Ugh. Yuck. But yeah, that makes sense. That, that, yeah. Yeah. I don't want this card. I want a, something else. Oh, nope. You know? Connected yet? I, uh, I kind of, maybe the pirate would have, the, uh, the beast would have been okay. We'll see. Next turn we can coin out a sleepy or we can 
coin the slither boy, maybe. Probably watch your VODs two to three times more than I watch live. I watch so many YouTube videos that are, you know, basically just VODs. I prefer watching those actually, I think. Like for a lot, I like, I like to watch a lot of, I'm back on Magic the Gathering content. I like to watch LSV. And I've watched LSV live, but I prefer, what is this card doing? I prefer to, um, to watch the YouTube videos where I can like, Fast forward, or I mean, I don't really fast forward, but no, I like, just like the YouTube videos. Watching you in the morning with coffee as I'm waking up is part of my routine. It feels weird when I don't do it. Well, I better never stop streaming or die, otherwise, you're food. It's got a hex, it's problematic. I like watching Andrea Mangucci play Cube. Yeah, so I watch LSV play Vintage Cube, but um, Andrea Mangucci's good too. I like him. I like uh, Reed, Reed Duke. I like Marshall too. I like um, I like Numot. Probably LSV and Numot are my two favorites. What is Mangu playing right now? It's like he's playing some constructed deck. That's not a. It's not a cube. Give me your best shot. Oh no, looks like it lost due to time. If we didn't roll healing totem, this would be really nifty. Oh well. I'll go through the drafts and when it's a fun deck, I'll watch it before bed. Oh, okay, yeah, that's smart. Yeah, you can see like just the good ones. That's kind of the the appeal of the YouTube, I'm sure too. The YouTube videos, because it's just the, you know, it's the better performing decks um, or the fun decks make it up to the YouTube. So you can kind of like cherry pick it that way. You know what, actually, I might want to check out again? I used to watch a guy, uh, Nitsahon, I think was his name. And he would do top 8 lists, or top 10? MTG top... Top 10s? It's not that good. But, uh, we would just say, like, you know, the top 10 2 drops, the top 10 cards from, you know, a specific expansion, the top 10 whatever. I always liked that. But he had a cool system, um... For, for ranking it based off of competitive results. So like in the big Magic the Gathering tournaments, cards like this is the best two drop, this acquired the most points, he had a point system. I like that one. Hi YouTube, I don't know if this run's gonna make it at three and two, we gotta win some more games. On weekends I love waking and bacon and that's when I'm more active in chat so you could ignore me more. Honestly, the jokes sound way better in my head. <laughs> yeah, they are, they are better in your head. Top 10 Rangers, Amgam, Magma, Ice, yeah, yeah. There's probably a couple others, what, what, what else we got? It's hard because for Hearthstone, I thought about trying to do it, but for Hearthstone it's like... It's so subjective because there's not like a tournament structure. So you'd have to say like this is the best. You could reference HS Replay and have it re re be really analytical, but... It's hard to get old HS replay data, and it's like, was this card good when it came out? Is it still good? So you just really kind of can't avoid that level of subjectivity, I feel. Um, I mean, I really want to wallop him. That was a mistake. You should have stayed I, on but I can't. If you want to learn, it's probably more educational to watch a good player take a two to three win deck to five, or like watching how someone drafts a somewhat functional synergistic deck 
while offered relatively underpowered cards. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, if you're trying to just get better, then I think that just watching like a, a, a variety of results and classes and approaches is probably a better, you know, than just watching the, the decks that kind of autopilot themselves and are really strong. That to me looks like it should be a beast. It's like a, an octopus or something. Comprehension. One, two. It only deals three fucking damage. Wait, three's pretty good. I still can't go face though. All right, at some point I'm gonna unload on this guy. I don't know when that that what? time is. Dead or alive. Should I discover a mech, a pirate, or a beast? What class? Should I just be flinging? That's 8? 14. Depends on the class. Alright, whatever. It's in my deck. It's 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 a good draw. Druid? Uh It's not a pirate. Either a beast or a uh or a mech. You're looking for Goliath or the Colossal, uh, which is a beast. Can you get the eight mana? Yeah, you want you want Sneed's Goliath. It's Goliath Sneed thing. Druid Colossal isn't that good. Well, it's still good though. Did Depending on the board state. Fuck me, dude. Fuck me. Why did I put him at 15? That's fine. I'll probably draw Burns Bar. Seems like something I would do. 6, 12, and I draw the other thing, and we just, you know, we're good. Oh, yeah, he could have um, got himself down, though, by whacking a couple minions, right? So we were never going to really be able to avoid that. Which Colossal's best? I think the Hunter one has the highest win rate. But uh, I think most people would agree Hunter. Hey, Liz. Uh I think most people would agree Hunter or Warlock. What the fuck? Did I have lethal? I'm stupid. I know chat saying things, but I'm. I wasn't looking. In my defense, I wasn't looking. He gave us lethal. I didn't imagine that he would take so much damage. This guy is making pretty bad plays, me or him? Because <laughs> I just had 12 damage against my opponent who was at 12. I wasn't watching the game though. So I need to kill him with my top deck so that he doesn't know that I had lethal. All right, whatever. Let's give him a chance. Okay, I think I just, I need a snacky poo, you know? I need a snack. Extended BM? Yeah, give him a chance. I just, I factored in the damage a turn before. And then saw he threw up a giant taunt. And I forgot he was just intermittently whacking minions left and right. No turning back now.
I've enjoyed having this card. I'm going back to Clink Clank Town. Water is back on the menu. What are these words? What town is that? And am I welcome there? I'm happy to get that trade. That'd be cool. Let's see. What do I take? Hmm. I guess I'll run it in if I, you know, have to invest any mana in the future. You're the freaking mayor on the days you're not getting tatty blasted. The mayor of, uh, where was I, the mayor? But yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah, the mayor, you say. Kind of like just freezing him, getting more value out of these. Just, just wax that one. It's not cool, man. Not cool to be whacking me or tatty blasting me. As Les said, whatever the hell you he was talking about. No ways can save Ten. The ship. You know, that's not great. No that ain't great. Hey, how did you get this skin? This is a nice Arana. Really? Weird. Um, play this. Steady the sound. Sure. He's either gonna take more to kill with his hero power. He's got a trade. Maybe he's awkward here. Like, he's like, maybe he just has a night captain, and everything I do doesn't matter. Yeah, that's possible. Yeah, that's not a big deal. Uh, yeah, there's a chance, Celeste. God. Damn, there's a chance. Hey, Nilt. Yeah, I'm trying. Oh, Lord, how I'm trying. Thank you so much, Nilt, for the prime. Just here streaming, playing some Earth, trying to... Trying to get some wins. Uh... I don't want this to take damage. He draws two cards. Two is strong. <clears throat> that gets a lot of burn. Being able to push some reasonable damage would be nice. Strictly. Talking to a nice gal for the past couple of days. Oh lordy, very That's nice, Zelly. What happened to the lasagna lady? We don't talk about her. What happened to the lasagna lady? Why does this card... How many do I have? Two? Um, why does this card always farm me? Why? Okay, I can bump and shoot. That's kind of nice. I need resources. But it's like they don't want to give me any. She broke my heart. That's not good. You need a heart for bumping blood. Watch this play. This kind of sick. Not the worst. Build your own crab or something. I mean, it's a boar, but... It's okay, we like what we like, and we slightly dislike what we don't like. So true, Zelda. Truer words, very rarely been spoken. Also, what the hell did you just say? Every time that this card has come out, it has absolutely whooped my pathetic keister. Play the taunt, yeah. And the raid boss. It's like, yeah, you can, you can cleave, but... 
Where did that come from? It means mistake. Oh no. It's gonna hurt me. What's going on, folks? Hey, Drum. Nice to see you here. In my neck of the woods. Love don't cost a thing. Sometimes love costs a lot. Like if you're paying a lady to spend time with you. It's gonna be very pricey unless legally speaking, of course. You should have stayed on your Uh should I position like that? Maybe. Protects the 5-9, which is pretty cool. So he can cleave them both. Oh yeah, that's good. Oh, that might not be good. Wait, is that good? Yeah, that's good. Inconceivable. He's done though. Let's kill him next turn then. That doesn't cost a thing. That's what rich aristocrats say. You mean like a les, the richest aristocrat I know? Dead or alive. I wanted to see. I wanted to show him also the power of the slinger. Hey, five wins, dude. That's so good. I mean, it's not that good, but we were two and two, or one and two, or something. And we got five. There's a chance we might get six. That's that's better than it's better than the alternative. Khadgar versus Malfurion. We might get six. We could. We get a high enough win total. There's no the uh, you know. Ladies and the gentlemen, they may be they may become attracted to us because of our prowess at a Hearthstone Arena. Is this a better hand? I would say maybe. Probably not. Pleasure running into you. It is a pleasure running into Junoon. Uh Zach Owner. Zach Owner. Zach owner. Thanks for the follow. Hopefully we can get up to like, I don't know, 20, 30 more, 50. Some new followers. We got Zach Owner though, that's pretty good. Wicker Claw. Definitely will consider killing that. Um, I don't think it's necessary, but I don't know, drawing the uh, the torch is kind of cool. You just draw the torch. Things you never knew you wanted. What was the last non Hearthstone game that I played? Uh, <laughs> Ace Defender yesterday. Uh, before that, Monster Train probably. I rather enjoy Monster Train. No, I wanted to draw that. It's a lot of health. Oh, that's not a lot of health. Shoot. Shoot. I should play a little more Monster Train. I really enjoy that game. I should pick, probably pick up Slay the Spire. I enjoy that game. Well, I've never played it, but I think I would. Maybe I'd be very good at it. You never know. You can't know for certain. I got a, I got a ping. I have to ping. And do I want to add a spell? Yeah, maybe. I can go four two, hopefully. Wow, that's a sick combo. Okay, I don't know what we're doing anymore. Any cute interactions on this board? Uh, I think there must be more. I know you can open this and get a tentacle out. I know you can change that. 
I know you can change this guy. I know you can blow some bubbles out of here. No ways can sink the ship. Okay, uh, let's shoot that. I'm not gonna waste this. Um, we have a flame strike if we want it. It's only a 2 4. I don't really care. He's like bumping and hero powering. How do you feel about the current arena? I personally despise it due to its divers. I really like it. I think it's a lot of fun. I wish the divers would, would go the way of the dodo, but they're not the worst thing in the world, honestly. I'd rather Night Captain go than most of the divers. We could do a co op on down to, on Slay? Yeah? Maybe. I'd rather this guy go. All right, let's see what spell. We might trade that. First flame's not bad, but we might do two mana to kill his importer. We could. We'll take it. Let's um, let's ditch this guy. Ah, I love Bonker. I want Bonker. I need some cards. Slay's my second most watched game on Twitch. What do you watch, Jorbs? I love Jorbs. There's a co-op? Yeah, probably. So do I, I think I can polymorph it, right? Yeah, let's do a poly. It's an 8-8, eight, eight. we deal six to it for two. We... Oh, we can eat it, duh. I ping it down to three, I bump it. I ping it. I trade it. I get some cards. I bump it. Ping it. I trade it. Um, okay, so we're gonna go amulet next turn. So I definitely want to kill it. This might not always work, right? I assume it will, but it might not always work. I watch Life Coach a bit, but not too much. Jorbs? Jorbs is the best. I watch when Dog plays it and Life Coach. I like all three of those guys. But I met Jorbs in person and he was nice. I think. Oh uh, yeah, well I mean I know I'm I know he was nice. I think I met him in person. <laughs> it was at TwitchCon. I, I met him and and Fitzy, I think they were hanging out, and Filthy Robot, who is a uh, another strategy streamer. But you do them small right? hand yeah I mean fortunately we're playing against a druid so it's fine. sometimes it doesn't matter but it looks strong it looks strong don't get me wrong it looks strong Let's see what's in uh and oh Anixia is so strong oh mama that was poo I still have a good card okay. Could have been better. Life coach would rope on turn one. Video ropey. He he ropes during the mulligan, I found out. <laughs> oh, I mean video blobby. You should check him out. Really nice guy. Yeah, put a lot of health on the board. It's kind of hard, right? Oh no, you just hero power. What am I talking about? I thought that we were gonna kill that though. I really did. Thought it was a possibility. This card should not exist. Just throwing it out there. We might still win, blah blah blah, this and that. This card is annoying. Why would this Puffer Fist be able to mow down all the mighty Onyxia and all that cool stuff. Doesn't make sense. The flavor fail. Um, I got like a buttload of damage. I think I must, I must have lethal. It's 12. That's a million, dude. Burning them up with my mighty dragon. Cool. Well, 
It was a rough run to start, and it's ended up really cool. Really fun. Just need one more win for the Yes Boys, right? I'm assuming seven. And to go infinite. And infinites, yeah. That's good. Alright, wait, one more win. Parrot win more value. Yeah, we didn't quite need him, but. Alright, stretching my legs. Turning back now. Druid and get this druid out of here. These have been good though. I like this card. Gives us a little bit of uh oh dear. Luckily we can trade the Drake Fire. It's a terrible card to have in our opening hand though. Uh gives us a little bit of wiggle room with our HP, right? Plus some value. Oh if I necessarily want two of them. Priest, Demon Hunter, or Warrior? Oh, easily Demon Hunter, if you're trying to win. I could play that coin ping, maybe? Shall we put a kink in their plan? Uh, I can't ping now. Maybe I just forgotten torch it. If we pick up a flame strike, it could be really nice. No ways can save the ship. Are you only wearing one sock? No, I've got two socks on. Could you even see my feet? That one's gray and has the Simpsons on it. That one's pink. Maybe my foot looks like that's the same hue. <laughs> Alright, not the 2 2, please. An actual good player, dang. Um. You get a free trade, which is nice. I can go to coin. Um, let's do this. We're gonna need to hit a 10. Stealth? Okay, stealth's not so bad. Uh, we might have to go Pyro next turn. I have things you never it's curving out you like wanted. such a wicked curve here. These are due back tomorrow. So the hero powers goes face. We trade. Uh, we're gonna, I guess. Hmm. What do we? What do we do? I have to cast two spells if I want to kill anything. It's probably not worth it. This could be good, but it's a bomber. It's probably not. Let's get a 10. No ways can sink the ship. Let's get a little bit of breathing room on this board. You could trade and bore your guy this turn. I don't think we want to do that. Okay, it wasn't um, Miracle Growth, which is good. I'm not removing that much. I mean, that's not true, I am. 
Where's my flame strike? I got a mage deck with Ibis and Raid Boss. Nice. Uh, thank you, Ziggy, for the sub. Make sure you queue into Dreads with that one. He loves when people from chat queue into him. What's moving over there? Trade that. I don't want to though. Hopefully he has like a bad turn. Like good, eh, good turns one through seven. Maybe eight is a little less good. Maybe. That's not great. Hello, hello, hello. It's a little better. And the silence. Interesting. Okay, well, we pick up Flame Strike. We're good. Mm, actually, we're not. We don't really want Flame Strike this turn. What do we want? I want a Bonker. Play it at three, six, seven, eight, nine, and we're at sixteen. It's not that low. The rest of our cards don't really do anything. That was unfortunate for sure, but what are you gonna do? Rapier makes Mage look like it's a first half of the previous meta. What? You're not getting in this way. Okay. We need one good draw. That's all. We get a bunch. <laughs> get a bunch of draws. I, I'm never dead here though. On board. Uh yeah, that's fine. I mean not great, but. No, so we go here, I draw one, I trade there, I ping there. Okay, we, we draw one for free. Sleepy, wow. <laughs> That's kind of enticing. Um, so we trade, we ping, we trade. Yeah, I think I might just sleepy now. Oh, that's like such a terrible draw, but it's good. Hmm. Otherwise, we trade there, ping there, trade there, draw two, and then convert one in, trade there. He has three, four, five. Oh, we, we still die. Okay, you know, if we whiff on everything, then we would die. I suppose we can draw a flame strike right now before we sleepy. All right, I just hope no, no rush or whatever, or no burn or another silence trade to draw again then i can't play sleepy ah. sorry i just sliced my finger with a piece of cardboard um it's okay though because we have a little bit of time now I can mow down most of this board. This one's mine. I want to play this though. So we don't have to. We can go for like a counter or a, or a um like an ice barrier or something. Trade is in to draw again. The bonker. Oh yeah yeah yeah. Okay. I thought you meant trade the snake. This one's Comprehension. Next turn. I mean, if we live, that's great. <laughs> um, let's ping here. Uh, 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 uh. Right, let's get some stuff on the board so we can go back in. Jayfire probably sets up lethal next turn. Um, possibly. We don't have to ruin, huh? Oh, you mean- yeah, we have the Pyroblast, huh? Oh. 4, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Ay, ay, ay. I don't want to miscount. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 11. 
18, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10. I have not cast a Pyroblast in a long time. Leave me be. 4, 5, 6. <laughs> Leave me be. This one's mine. Scared. I don't want to. That was a really close game. I want to give it away. Alright, crawled all the way back up from... I think we were 2-2 two two actually, or 1-2, and two, but we weren't 0-2. Oh and, and we can pay out the yes boys, we can get another bet going. Get another bet going. Will we win 7? Yeah. Let's get one for 10. I'll have you guys 2 minutes on 10. Oh, 18, 11 plus 4, yeah. That was a really close game, and I didn't want to lose. I didn't want to lose. Um, I'm gonna go grab a drinky poo. Cadgar versus Illidan. This ends now. There's no turning back now. Oh, I'm back. The hell did I just touch? Is gamble only for subs? No, everybody can gamble. As long as it's legal where in the country where you're from. It's uh region locked for some people. But I don't I don't choose that. I might coin out. It's a good draw. Play that and keep our coin. I don't love it, but I don't really want to float mana. I don't want to necessarily give up the coin either. It's not a particularly strong card to coin out a 3 4. Our deck's not really like smorking him down, you know what I mean? Like we're gonna have to play a long game that, you know, we have to kind of play some attrition. But we can, we could. Just curve out and, and you know drop a fireball and a pyroblast, but I thought that would happen more with this deck through the first you know nine games, but it hasn't been the case. Yeah, I don't need That's certainly not what I wanted to draw here. Um That's a good draw. I'm probably going to trade it, but gaining the life is kind of cool. Ten armor's a lot. Can you say attrition really slowly? Attrition. Okay, well. <laughs> I mean, if he's not developing any power, that's fine. Like, that can attack me. I'm going to have to set up a... Setting up a flame strike. So let's trade this. I definitely don't want that. Uh, we're gonna coin a flame strike next turn. Need light over here, standing oh. So I give up the bomber to try to get him to play a little more. What was today's card impression? We did a uh, reform from Rise of Shadows, Rot Face, and uh, the horse. Gigor really likes to make me do the horse sound. Three left. I haven't cast anything. Wanted, dead or alive. Oh my gosh, I'm giving up all my minions this turn. You can't stop these snow 
Storm. We're gonna have to flame strike at some point. Uh, blow Twitch up. What the? Blow Twitch up. That doesn't sound like a good idea. Armored Warhorse, yeah. Am I a sub? You are, yeah. You used your points. I subbed you earlier, Iron. Alright, this will give us a turn or two, perhaps. Pretend like I'm like gonna make this trade form. Why would you ever go face here? Okay. <laughs> This gives us another turn to like, kind of replenish our, our minion stores. We hit another minion next turn, then we should get pretty good bridge value, right? Four, two, three. We could do four, two, three. Have to use our coin, but then this guy will be pretty much, he'll, he'll be active, right? Not pretty much, he's just active. Um, how badly do I need to kill that? Pretty badly. Red, the minion store is only in battlegrounds. I don't understand the words that are coming out of your mouth. Well, the characters that are being typed by your fingers. Alright, no coin? Ah, uh, should I just look? But man, like... The queen's power is beyond your I... comprehension. Let's see, what do I do? Mm, what is this? I'm dredging? I want a minion, actually. I know that looks a little wacky, but I want um, I want minions while I have the bridge value. Play bridge and then amulet into Onyxia. That could be cool. If that was on the bottom of our deck, that would be nice. Um, I need one. Oh, we're gonna light this board up. But I'm gonna need... I probably... No, I might not need to ping anything, right? We'll see. Mm. Is it just me? Also, anybody? I, like, sometimes I lose track of time. Has this run been going on a really long time? Is this just like for a seven win run? This feels long. I also kind of feel out of it today. I don't know. It's popping off at Sentinel. Yeah, I mean, what can you do though? I mean, he drew one or two cards last turn. He'll draw one or two this turn. He's drawn a few extra cards, and we have two bonkers, so maybe we'll get, uh, Jesse, maybe we'll get to uh, catch up a little bit. Why is that in the taunt tag? Uh, there was, somebody came up with all of those. I think he disconnected? They must have. Well. I know we wasted a mana, but we had to use a spell to activate him, so... It's gonna have ignited his face, maybe. Ignite's more valuable than the coin. Um, <clears throat> yeah, they made that... Some guy, like, was memeing when I first started. I can't remember who it was. It was they're, they're not here anymore. What they were talking about, but they they had they they reworked all of the keywords. That's the only one that saved. That's the only one that made it through. One instance of poison, you get poison. Two instances, it kills the player on hit. Three, it kills you when you click it. Four, it kills you when you hover over it. And five, if you get five poisons, it kills all of Hearthstone. But all the cards did like stupid shit like that. It was really funny. Ignite the guy I pinged? That's just wasting damage though, right? Short. There's like no need. This deals two, ping deals one. Oh. In a deck that has a Pyroblast, and a Forgotten Torch, and a Fireball, and the Ignite, every, every damage could matter. Six kills you in real life. That's probably where that would have gone. I think we would have won this anyway. We were very far ahead. We had the bridge. 
but well, this connects always kind of suck, right? Win trade. Good old lucky arena. The old win trading son of a gun. I'm gonna go over to Reddit. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> My sister texted me. She said that her boyfriend's gonna be here in two days and he's coming to arrest me. So I, I said to him like, Mo. I said, so I'm writing my sister, Mo, who's that? I must protect the one. There's no turning back now. Yeah, really throw her off the, she'll be, she'll be confused. She'll be scared. Looking forward to it. Did you celebrate 420? Uh, was that today? Uh, let's see. T what did I do today? I woke up at like 3 or 4. I couldn't sleep that, that late. And I was like, hmm, I'm gonna try to go back to bed. I was like, nah, I'll just get up. Uh, I watched some Dreads. I played some Battlegrounds. I ate a little bit of food before the stream. Not enough, I'm hungry, I didn't nap, and I started a little early. So I'm just here, just, this is, you know, this is it. Redbeard has the best subreddit. True. What? I'm assuming that's an NSFW sub. I have Red gone wild. You There are no posts in this subreddit. Come on, what does a lady have to do to see a Harry back? Who's Harry back? What? Harry back? This is a very large three drop. Maybe I, I play this and coin that next turn. I've really got a fart and I think it's gonna make a lot of noise. So I'm gonna try. It didn't make any noise, and I'm a little worried about what happened down there. But that's a problem for future Redbeard. With me, friend. I thought it'd be naked redheads. That's kind of what I was hoping for when I went to peruse. When I went to investigate. No ways can save the ship. I try to go fast. I, I just... The, the eight wind druids are just gonna gonna rush you down and clear your board. So I'm gonna take the damage and maybe find enough burn, which I got two burn spells, so maybe. Red beard gone wild. No, it wasn't red beard gone wild. Wait, was it? No, it was just red gone wild. Red gone wild. Wait, but now I have an issue of not being able to use this again. Alright, let's do this. I'm just going face. I got a little bit of burn. I mean, I got a whole crap load of burn at this point. Maybe you're playing Wild Hearthstone, you should feel ashamed. I like Wild Hearthstone. I've been playing my 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 Guff deck. Copied it from the internet. Uh, actually, Tennis Damo gave me the list, or I looked up a list based off of his suggestion. Well, and I got a lot of crumbs on me. Also, this shirt, I feel like it's stretched out. I don't know. Too loose. My opponent played three scales in a row. Unfortunately, I'm playing a Scumbag Priest and had three AoEs. Nice. I assumed it was clips of drunk red hooting and hollering over top decks. <laughs> I used to get a bad rep on the internet. Said that I was hooting and hollering too much. I don't think I ever hooted and hollered that much. That card's good. And will defeat me. Bye-bye uh, board, I guess. 
Luckily, he's not getting another one. Unfortunately, he is clearing my board and... Oh, is that a beast? That's not a beast? How? How is that not a beast? To me, that seems like a beast. Observe and reflect. Kind of hoping to score some spells, but we whiffed. Yo, Beard, has this song been playing for an hour? Uh. Maybe. <laughs> Let's see. What do I take? Sometimes the YouTube kind of get bugged out. Was it playing for an hour? <laughs> Sorry. If yes. Is that the JW Yog? Did you add Queen Ashara to it? I did not. Should I? Next on the chopping block. Oh, that's not fair. All right, flame strike me. Hang. Uh, that's a beast. I need a. I need so much help. I need a miracle. Beyond your comprehension. That's right. I need help. Also, hey, Duker. <laughs> My bad. I. That's not good. Climbing standard with no star bonuses are rough. Finally hit platinum after not getting there for a year. Yeah, that is weird. They should just give you a star bonus. Night captain that summons a 2-2. Finally playable. Ah, uh, no rune in our deck. No flame strike in our hand. That card would have been good about nine turns ago. I mean, whatever. We'll just like click some buttons for a bit. I suppose it's possible next turn we get a flame strike. His hand plays into flame strike, maybe. Outskill, as I always say, the better player won. Sneeds that summon two twos. <laughs> Finally playable. Oh. Yeah, they need to they need to make that card they need to make that card stronger. I only have one spell. What if I draw a cheap spell? Like um What if I draw like a there's nothing cheap enough. Fook. That's fine. I think Sneeze is too weak. Need to summon five two tools. I would like to ban you from the development of Hearthstone. Okay. If we get a flame strike this turn, I don't think the game's 100% over, which is kind of nuts. Right, we're, we're in an okay spot then. Dang it. Inconceivable. Alright, well, I'm not wait, I still I still can't even kill the two fucking four. Unleash the beast. Well, I don't doubt that that's we're coming back. Not even for half a second. Seven drop plus ping kills the two four. Well, yeah, that's not that good, but yeah, that's true. It's true, but it's not that good. About two turns too late. Handle it. About two turns too late, but if we get a little lucky, maybe a. Uh, Drake fire amulet right now? 
Mad Donger? You think he fooks me again? Possibly. Hopefully not. Alright, I'll take it. Two to him, one to me. Drake Fire Amulet, give it to me right now. Give it to me, baby. We could get a deep water evolver, evoker. Inconceivable. Four, nine, forgotten torch. Shut the hell up, you hooting hollering murloc! Gosh darn it. My opponent got my copycat with the copycat. Gave me another copy with my copycat and he copied it. And then got my other copycat with his psychic conjurer. <laughs> That's pretty funny. That's pretty funny. Would it be nuts if you win this game? Yeah, that'd be cool. That would be cool. No. <laughs> oh, he gave the armor. Okay. Sure. Uh, I don't play this this turn, right? I do this. No sense in giving him a spell when I don't want that at all. Uh, 13. 13, he's at 17. My gosh, we're close. We're close. We have a lot of good draws. Deathwing? No, not Deathwing. We get a hex from this if he gets a Deathwing, right? Oh, I love this song. Never mind. On the mix that this song is on, I love the next song, but I don't think it's coming up on this mix. Is this the name of a pro player? I think this is somebody from chat. But then you faced you with five attack last turn. Uh, I think he just drew that, no? Maybe? It's at 18. So I can trade and ping, which is nice. I think a 6-7 is better than a 4-12. I'm gonna play it safe. As safe as I can. Don't. Okay, wait. Is it health? Oh yeah, health. That's right. Okay. Inconceivable. You want it? I got it. Shoot. Suffocate. I don't want my taunt to take any damage. Don't think you want to play the Spell Slinger? No, I don't. Ideally, unless I have to. You know it's giving him lethal. I can see. Anyway, I wasn't really worried. If you think I was. Crazy. What's the goal about? We're doing a uh, some sponsored content. We're not going to play any more Ace Defender today. But, um... We are, are 
incentivized to get some downloads and if people make it to level 3-1 you gotta beat level 3-1 then that counter goes up and they'll give us some extra money which is always cool and you might have fun playing it you never know you don't want your taunts to take damage until they have Troll Centurion. Oh, yeah. That's true. I always forget about that card. These bonkers are pretty critical. Is Night Captain summoning 2 2 too weak this meta? Uh, I'm not sure exactly what you're asking for. If you mean adding that to what it already does, then. No, that's not too weak. That bird after the flame strike, hey. That bird after that flame strike, that was pretty good. There's a QR code for it, so if you, you if you you can download the game through that QR code, and then we'll get credit. If you just download the game just on your own, then we won't get credit. You can also click the link which appears in chat, or we can uh, help if you actually you know if you want to do it. It does take a little bit of time, 10, 15 minutes, but you can kind of just, you know, it's not super in intensive or anything. Or some card impression. Um, I'm gonna ping this before he gets too wide. I'm gonna want a, that on the, on the board, right? Me, hungry! You're yummy. <laughs> Me like. <laughs> <Ugh. laughs> That's a weird card. Why does it talk? I've right, been streaming for six hours, twenty-four minutes. <laughs> Not bad. All right, all right. We do it again tomorrow. I'll try. I'll practice it. Okay. Can I do Ace Defender on desktop? Uh, I think you have to run it through an emulator if you do that. A legal emulator, like Blue Stacks or some. I played on Blue Stacks. Reporting for duty. <laughs> Actually, getting better. No, some of them are just more conducive to my talents. I mean, we just kind of we don't win the game, but we sort of just win if I can drop that, right? I just really started to master the generic ghoul dying sound. <laughs> uh, it works fine with blue stacks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. This is... This is good. Does this card get played in Mech Mage? Or in any of the mech decks in uh, Constructed or nah? I'm gonna kill it so it doesn't blessing up king something. Not sure what blue stacks is. It's like an emulator for mobile games for your desktop. Um, let's just do this. I don't want to give him this. So if we play, play, get two small minions, it could be a little better. It is because anything with mech tag or mech synergy is played. You might find a good place to get retro shirts from. Uh, eBay, probably. Um, thrift shop. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 15, 16. I get two cards. I could find a little more burn, maybe. I just need to burn him. I just need a spell that does a thing, right? Holy light! This guy's about to dredge? No, he's gonna die. Is there a card that heals him to full? That there's like a one mana repeatable heal, right? Have an audience with the king. Ah! 
I like the ones you wear. Can I buy those for channel points? Sure. Well, no, you give me US dollars. I'll give you my worn out, disgusting, streamer sweat saturated versions. Um, I got most of these shirts from Target or whatever, you know, like five bucks. Uh, this one, um, Darth Chubby bought. I don't know where he bought it from, actually. Amazon or something. Maybe. What's up? New website coming out. You asked for it. There's no turning back now. Popeyes is back. Thanks, Popeyes, for the prime. Uh, this card's just not very good. I don't have a spell. I'm gonna get a spell. I'm gonna fall off the board if I don't play it. That's fine because I can trade the Drake Fire. I mean, it's not fine, but <laughs> I need a two. Be fine if I draw a two right now. Okay, now it's fine. Uh, Carlos, thanks for the follow. Thank you very much, Carlos. And Popeye is back. Popeye. Need to pay for the hazmat team that will handle Red's clothes. Oh gosh, why are they always handling my clothes? I kind of don't want to kill this guy. Is that silly? Let him throw it away. He can bump and ping. Psych with the gifted sub to Cocaine Pixie Sticks. Thank you so much, Psych. Oh gosh. Thank you so much, dude. You ever need anything? You ask Zelda, and he'll do it for you. You ever ask me, you will regret it. <laughs> uh, JD King, thanks for the follow. JD King. I'm seven years ahead. Dude, you wretched little worm. I hate this card, it's so good. Um, what are we doing here? I mean, either way, I'm casting these two, right? If I ping it, I can get two cards. If you guys don't know what this guy does, choose to counter the next minion or spell your opponent plays. That card is really good. Would love to play this. Countering it sucks. So what am I supposed to do with that? Man, I have to float so much mana now. Oh god, that card is good. It's cool looking too. Kind of looks like me when I take off the streamer uniform. Well, Bonker has been surprisingly good. I like that card. I think it is a fine card. Ah, yet again, we have our choice here. Not sure which one's better. This makes this a threat. Which allows us to shoot. But this card just, sometimes there's nothing you can do. Sometimes you just get kind of walloped by it, right? And that's what I'm hoping for. It's not like Scalebane's hard to get value out of either, so. If this was a, if this was a 4-4, four, four, I would play the Scalebane. That is a good trade for us. I'm not sure why they gave us that. I'm also not sure what I can do other than play the scale vein, but you could you could play two small things. But uh... oh, I had more mana than I thought. I could have played these two maybe. It's fine. A 5-5 five is kind of nice. It still matches up with the board pretty well.
How many spells do I have left? Three more? Golly gee willikers, that's too much. I hope this fits on the ship. It's too much right there. Time runs out on me. Interesting. Not a very good turn for him. Again. Can run that in, buff some stuff. No ways can sink the ship. Not really what I'm looking for. Oh my golly, G Willikers, I love these tracks. I haven't heard these ones for too long. Shafted a rogue deck that is quite illegal. Got the choice between Sneeds, Smite, and Crab Taro. Went for the crab, and later got the pick between Ivis and Ysera, and some random legendary. I picked Ysera, and I also got Corset Anixia. Imagine if that was Ray's bo raid boss, yeah. Make sure you queue in a dreads. <laughs> Make sure you dreads. We'd love to, you know, we'd love to face the challenge of this egg. Yeah, two reconnaissance, some pirate jars, yeah, that's good. Where did that come from? Oh, we dredged it, duh. Boom, boom, boom. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. I don't want the reduction. I want two cards. I'm only reducing one fucking card anyway. Yeah, that deck looks cool, Ma. Chat is so slow. So I might share something. I got cold in my back a couple weeks ago. Still can't sit without back getting sore. I just lay in bed and watch old red nerd. What are you even saying? One card could be played next turn. Yeah. That's true. What? And you know what? Dead or alive. His gigantic minion kind of makes me wish. No, wait, where's my. I need it. Wanna blow something up? Darn it. Darn it. And darn it. Okay, Bomber's back to his usual self. Good news, everyone. You don't have to worry about anything. Not to worry about anything. Don't know what he's saying, but he is right. You sure? Because I'm thinking he might be. Maybe not right. You ever played Chrono Trigger? I played the one for the Super Nintendo, but I, I got stuck looking for like a rat or a toad or something. I think I was looking for a mouse in like a in a warehouse. My brother says I wasn't very far, but I couldn't figure it out. So I gave up. I never played it anymore. I liked it, but I didn't love it, clearly. I didn't play it till I was like 20 or so, maybe. I don't remember. I might have played it on an emulator. It might have not felt as good. I don't know. I never had it for, for the actual Super Nintendo. I collected Super Nintendo games. Ooh, okay. So we got a... Uh... All right, I need Flame Strike right now. I can't get through. Oh wait, I can probably. Pretty good. <laughs> oh, I can't. Oh yeah, yeah. Wait, I can. Constructed mech mage. Well, we're at 10 wins, right? You expect the decks to be good. How do I kill the 8 8? It's a beast, right? It's a beastly minion. The queen's power is beyond your comprehension. I might need to buy time. It's a simple mini game. What's a simple mini game? Wait, I need to know if he top decked it to know how mad I need to be. I did, so he just ripped, <laughs> just ripped Ray Boss into that. A little more frustrating when you know. 
are that much better than you. But it's fine. So not low rolls either. The rat thing, oh yeah? I don't even remember it. I just remember being stuck there. But I don't remember what even happened. I don't recall. Honestly, this flame strike kind of sucks. I guess I could flame next turn again, but that's not probably not good enough. I don't know why we're we're even bothering. I mean. Raid boss into the dragon thing and high rolling the dragon thing is kind of. If you played that dragon spell turn 9, it would have looked a bit different. Yeah, it would have been different. We still would have lost, but yeah. You can't analyze games that way. You have to make the best play on the turn that it's available to you. And then if your opponent has cards with 80% win played win rate while, while they're ahead. Then you just have to accept that you would have lost. It's just, uh... You don't go back and, and... Play suboptimally to try to beat a future raid boss. It just doesn't work that way. Sometimes you have to accept your opponent had a good deck. And they played it well. And then you move on. Otherwise, you stay results oriented and you don't get any better at Hearthstone. <laughs> 